deal here? Can we bounce? Hush now. I need to pay my respects to an old friend. It's been 25 years, Rodney. 25 long goddamn years. Yeah, I know. I've been coming here with you for every last one of them. At least our tax dollars paid off. Finally tore this motherfucker down. The city didn't. No, you didn't. You didn't do that shit. You ain't lost your fucking mind, Joe. Who the hell you think you talking to? Some sentimental motherfucker. Posing as my brother. King motherfucking Joseph Leo. Let this shit go, man. It's the past. Yeah, I know. I was just wondering. I was thinking lately. About the past, you no know, mostly. About the choices we've made. About the choices I've made. Just wondering. You can't dwell on the past, man. Tyrone, that motherfucker got what was coming to him. Or do I need to remind you? An inch and a half over to the right, I'd be a dead motherfucker. Your brother. Do you recall where those other bullets landed? Almost hit Damon. You know who's responsible for all that shit? Tyrone Page. And you did what you, you were supposed don't to need do to me. as a boss, and you took his ass out. Yeah. I don't know. I just don't know. The hell you mean you don't know? Well, let me remind you. We driving down a motherfucking street. We going to get some fish from the fish joint, right? The preload. The preloads. Yeah, That's right. On the pharmacy not far from here. Yeah, sure motherfucking did. Next thing I know, glass start flying our way. Who is that? Dark motherfucker. Pitch black motherfucker. Who is that? Little bitch. Little, I know the bitch in there somewhere. Little bitch. Well, this ugly motherfucker, he catches three to the chest. I'm sitting right behind his ass. I was there. That's right. He was there. I know because I ain't never seen you like that. Like the devil got into you. It did, Rodney. It did. He didn't do it. Oh man, here you go with this bullshit, man. The fuck you mean he didn't do it? He didn't. They lied to me. Who? Who lied to you? The, the goblins. See? I knew you couldn't trust them motherfuckers. I knew something was up. You know, after the hit, Tyrone went underground. He always knew this city like no one else. I needed help. They tried to kill my son. I went to Caden for help. Later, Caden told me where to find Tyrone. Devil's Night, 1991. Yeah, I was still in the hospital, but I got word from the homies that you took some soldiers, firebombed his crib, like you were supposed to. Yeah. We got his girl. Somehow, Marco and Donna escaped. You know, I was always wondering was he there? In the house? Marco always said that when the fire woke him up, it was just him, Donna, and their mother. So you're telling me that uh, Tyrone probably wasn't even in the house? 
So that's why you went all super CSI and tore this motherfucker down, looking for him. You know, as you get older, you sleep less and less each night. I figure the body knows when the end is getting closer. The last couple of months, I've been awake at night, just sitting in the dark, 3 a.m., just thinking, just thinking. You know, those thoughts that keep your mind and soul from being at peace. I feel you, bro. Some demons, man. Being in this game for so long. I get those too. Yeah, come on, let's go. Uh, Rodney. Nothing. Let's go. We got an appointment with Izzy. Hold on, bro. See? Something's up. You been acting real strange lately. You got, you holding something from me. Soon, Rodney. Soon. Come on, let's go. We've disturbed these ghosts of the past long enough.